Harley Quinn debuted in Batman the Animated Series on September 11, 1992 in an episode titled Joker's Favor. A proposed but never developed fifth film in the Burton Schumacher Batman series would have introduced Harley Quinn on the big screen in 1999. Hi, I'm Tom from Cosmic Comic History and this is your Cosmic Minute and today we're talking about Batman Unchained. Batman Unchained, erroneously referred to as Batman Triumphant by the internet community, would have taken the Bat franchise back to its darker roots. Director Joel Schumacher was interested in returning back to the franchise. He was eager to offer fans a darker take on the Batman character, especially after the lighter offerings of Batman Forever and Batman and Robin. The movie would have introduced us to its primary antagonist, Jonathan Crane, aka the Scarecrow. It also would have introduced a secondary antagonist in the form of Harley Quinn, this time portrayed as the Joker's daughter. Nick Cage was sought after for the role of Scarecrow, with Courtney Love potentially portraying Harley Quinn. The most exciting aspect of the script was a fear-induced hallucination brought on by the Scarecrow's fear toxin that would have brought back Danny DeVito's Penguin, Michelle Pfeiffer's Catwoman, Tommy Lee Jones' Two-Face, Jim Carrey's The Riddler, and best of all, Jack Nicholson's The Joker. The critical failure of Batman and Robin derailed any plans for a fifth film in the franchise. However, several aspects of the script did make their way into the Batman Begins film. I'm still Tom from Cosmic Comic History, and that was your Cosmic Minute. Until next time, be well and stay safe.